Hey everybody, it's Greg Ryder from T Rex Ecom Tex Inc. The the partnership made in heaven, and we got an amazing little webinar for you here, talking about the next multi million dollar ecom niche. And for you guys who stick around, I got the most amazing offer. Randy and I brainstormed today, and Randy's like, I really want to sponsor some guys to come to the T Rex Ecom event. We want to sponsor some guys to come to the T Rex Com event. So in the next ten, this can be a real short webinar, by the way. In the next ten to fifteen minutes, we're going to give you guys an offer to get a guest ticket, which is basically a free ticket to T-Rex Ecom event in San Diego, absolutely 1% for free, uh, and you have to do just a very little bit to get this free ticket, very little bit, uh, but it's, 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 it's in our best interest to get you going, and it's going to be in your best interest you get this going, so let's talk about this. So I wanted to throw this together real quick and get this recording out there and then send out there one, the, the next multi-million dollar Ecom niche. And the reason I wanted to do that is because, and I'm going to turn my video on. I kind of like, I think it's, let me see here. Where's my video? I like it with the video. Share my webcam. Can you guys see my webcam now? Okay. So um, why am I saying this next million dollar e-com niche? And I, and, and I have to tell you, I am um, throwing some information, some content I got from another webinar. And... I saw this other webinar and I agreed with everything they said. And by happenstance, Randy and I, we in we invested and purchased a sign company. And when we purchased the sign company, we got this equipment to where we can service this particular niche. So I wish I wish I could say that Randy and I were so smart, we had the foresight to go buy the equipment to service the niche. But it was by accident that this kind of happened, and it was a win-win for everybody. And so. Um, well, I first want to kind of go over just some basics, right? So let's first talk about what does it take to have a killer market, right? Wh why would what can we do to make good money in e-commerce, make good money online, and, and what does that take? So the first thing that that takes is there has to be a mass market for your product, a mass market for your product. If you really want to make a lot of money and you really want to make it easy on yourself, is you have to have a mass market for your product. Now. That's not saying it's not good to go after niches and you can make good money in a niche, but there's a lot of money to be made in a mass market. Matter of fact, I'm going to even, uh, in the other webinar I watched, it was equated to this new niche is, is, is big or bigger than the t-shirt niche was when it started back in like 2013, right? This is a huge niche. been around for a long time, but online what it's doing is, is crushing it, right? So we need to have a massive demand for a product, a massive demand. And... You need to have a product where you have good margins, where you can buy it and have good markups to help pay for your media spend and acquire your customer, right? The more money you have for customer acquisition, the better off you're going to be. So you have a good, huge market with a big demand for a product or service. You have good margins in it, and you want to try to get in early and, and, and kind of get into an untapped market and be one of the leaders in that. And that's kind of what this is. This isn't like we're creating it. It is proven. Matter of fact, I've heard stories, and we know people that are making thousands of dollars a week, and I know some people that are talking about making fifty thousand uh, dollars a day in this particular niche. But it hasn't exploded, and it hasn't really got the, the you know, like T-shirts where everybody got into T-shirt business. And one of the reasons why it's a little bit more difficult to get into, it's a little bit more difficult to find a drop shipper, and you're still dealing with China, and with China. We got a little video coming up where they're talking about, you know, 21 days or 28 days for delivery and, and, and sometimes even longer than the communication gap, big problem. Well, we solved that problem, right? So you want to be in a good market with huge demand, with a great product. You want to get into it early. You want to ride the, the tide. And this, this market's getting ready to explode, and we love it. And I'm going to show one little screenshot here of an article. Art and e-commerce sales are booming, are booming. So that's what we're talking about. We are talking about canvas art. And canvas art is hot. It's got great margins. And now Randy at Printex, for the canvas art part of it, is can deliver for you to your customers from the United States of America, made in the United States of America, canvas art, at prices comparable to what you could get in China. But better product, faster delivery, better service. So I'm gonna play one video and then we're gonna we're gonna get Randy on here and we're gonna open up some stuff here. So let me see if I can find this video. 
So yeah, with that, Jeff, if you if you got a couple seconds, why don't you share, uh, you know, some of your ideas, things that have been successful that you're comfortable with, and uh, we'll talk about that. Uh, yeah, sure. Um, I mean, to to sum it up really quick, I mean, compared to China, um, you know, with Printex, you guys are uh, better, bigger, and faster. I mean, there's there's no competition at all with China. Um, with China, you're looking at 21 to 40 days on a regular order. Um, if you went to EMS, you're going 15 to 25 days, and that's after five to seven days processing. What I'm seeing with Printex on this wall art is two to five days. That's processing, uh, custom making it, and out to the customer. That's that's awesome. That's great. Uh, the quality is way better, um, and you know, like Randy has said, the uh, the sizes are bigger. So uh, you know, uh, for the price and the quality, there's really no comparison. Jeff, how long and have you been of, doing wall art? Uh, right about eight months, I think. And what what made you get into doing wall art? Uh, the profit margins. I mean, That's it's pretty whatever, simple. Whatever huh? niche. Whatever niche you're in, you can find a wall art that goes with that niche, and it's it's great for an upsell. Um, you know, if you're selling whatever you're selling in that niche, it's it's just a great upsell. So, are you leading with another product and then having the upsell, or are you leading with the wall art and, and downselling, or doing both? I'm actually doing both. I, I was just leading with the wall art, and now I'm just um, I'm doing using it as an upsell. And do you have any numbers on which one's working better, or does it really matter? Uh, it really doesn't matter. I mean, if, if you find a good quality design um, for that niche, and uh, just run it and test it and see what works. There's enough pro profit margin in it that uh, you, you know it's it's easy to test things out. Yeah, no, and, and we talked yesterday about that, and, and somebody asked me about the how do you target for wall art. Could you share with me what you said to me yesterday about how you target for wall art and, and why you can target that way? Um, well, I mean, if, if you've got niche specific, um, you know, with the profit margin in there, um, you can just target that niche pretty, uh, pretty broad and, you know, just test it out and see what works. That's really unique. All right, that's cool, man. That's awesome. We appreciate you sharing that. What about you, Randy? You got any other questions? I, I would uh, like to add um, the communication. Uh, you know, if anybody's ever dealt with China and you go back and forth for days to see if they figured out what you're talking about, um, if you're if you're requesting a custom design on the wall art or anything, and you know, for that matter. But you know, with Randy, he's so easy to work with. I mean, he'll get right on the phone with you, and you get figured out in a couple minutes. So that's that's another big plus. Well, it's, it goes both ways too. It helps me, uh, you know, get it solved quick. Doesn't slow up my production, and it's great to be able to just get on a call like with you and say, "Hey, we need it a different way, or how can we do it?" Also, I think what's helpful too, and I, I think I don't know if you've been able to use that tool or not, but once I get your piece done and I can throw it up on that green screen and throw it to you and, and uh, allow you to mock that up and uh, and show and and, and kind of dress up your site. Sure helps, doesn't it, Jeff? Oh yeah, that's great. Is it is that is that is that like part of the service, Randy? That you just you like over deliver? You're awesome. <laughs> yeah, it helps us all. I mean, you know, when you can see that and it looks like it's in an office environment, uh, it, it just gives it great credibility. Yeah. Yeah, yeah and it, and especially when you can say made and shipped from USA. Mm -hmm. I think that's important right now. How do I do this? The uh... I think I have to stop sharing my webcam. Share a video. You got to talk while I'm looking, Randy, because I'm, <laughs> I'm like, I set this up, but I've never done this before. There's a way to play a video through here. Okay, I'll bail you out, Greg. Yeah, yeah. <laughs> bail me out, exactly. You, you oh. know what? And on that, you know, we, we've been. We've been kind of fumbling through it, trying to make this stuff work for a couple months now in this canvas art and getting all of the, uh, you know, the production uh, challenges out of the way. And so really only the last couple, three weeks where we're at the point where we can 
ready to launch this stuff and be able to do it at a level that we need to to keep up with our customers. So you're right. You know, so uh, Dave and I, you know, partnered up and we acquired, uh, you know, his sign company, Hometown Signs, uh, that brought a lot of other production capabilities to what we're doing with the laser engraving for wine glasses, and, you know, on knives and other things. And, uh, uh, you know, through the process, uh, you know, Dave and I figured out a system where we can uh, generate this wall art. Uh, in an efficient way and being able to be competitive with, you know, our overseas competitors, and, and we did. So it, and it, it's much more simple than I thought it was up front from being able to manage the art side. Uh, Dave's an expert with, um, you know, Photoshop and in CorelDRAW, and so he's able to take, you know, a, a good quality photo, you know, something that's two to 300 DPI works the best. We can work with a lesser quality photo, but, of course, you get what you start with. And, uh, and and Dave's able to in a in a in a a fair amount of time be able to take that photograph and chop it into the five panels, you know, that we need to produce that finished product. Uh, so that was one big piece of the puzzle, along with the equipment that it takes to print out the the the, the quality canvas, and then and so she kind of walks you through that if you know anything about it, Photoshop, but. Also, to make it easy on you, if you've got some idea, some uh, uh, nice graphic or photograph, we'll mock it up for you. So you can send us that. We'll do the mock-up for you. You can put it in your site, and, uh, you know, we can help you keep it moving. So don't hesitate to reach out to me and say, uh, uh, do this mock-up. Replay. Back. Say that again. Yeah. yeah. Here we are back in our members area. When you log into the members area, you get to the screen like this, you click on the T-Rex training and stuff, you scroll down to the Photoshop tutorials, and come down here, lesson number six, how to mock up a five-piece canvas wall art photo. Click there, and here's a video of exactly how to do it in Photoshop. And then under downloads, always check your downloads, because we're supposed to be putting the downloads that are tied to the video here, and Michael's going to add that there, but I think that, I think that the download for this is under downloads, product giveaways, uh, I think it's in here somewhere. But anyway, you always got to check here for, for downloads and different places, but I'm going to try to get Michael to start putting those with the video itself. But great training, great stuff. There it is in the members area. You got to get that going uh, and get that happening. And, and I don't know why the video wouldn't play, so I'm just going to go ahead and send everyone this video. Everyone watch this video when we're done with the, web, with the webinar. I'll, Skype, I'll, I'll send it in the chat box. Boom. And the one thing that Randy and I did want to say, and we want this to be heard by everybody, um, and, and that is um, we really respect you guys as customers and clients. We respect your rights, your privileges, your artwork, your stores, and your right to privacy and, and, and that kind of stuff. And so we know that there's been a lot of people who have stole other people's artwork in this world of t-shirts and designs and coffee mugs. And we know that people have crossed the line and gone over into selling licensed products. And Randy and I, we as a corporation and with our vision and goals, we, we will not tolerate any of that. Um, and Randy, why don't you speak to that real quick because you know it, it's a big risk for Printex and uh, we want just everyone to know where we're coming from and, and why we're coming there. We want to understand that. Plus, we want to protect people that, hey, you know, we're not going to share your designs. And if it's a print text design or if it's on Planet Me T or something, we want you to use it. We want you to go with it. But you got to respect other people within our community and not copy them and steal their stuff. Oh, well, yeah, on that, Greg. I mean, uh, you know, the, the licenses that we're working with with our celebrities, for one, you know, what I've done in the past with college license, professional licenses, you know, I still continue to do that. And, uh, you know, I have to I have to honor the integrity of their license. And, and it's just stealing. You know, so I, I don't, and I don't need somebody, the biggest thing is I don't need a license, uh, the, the license police walking in here and shut me down. That has shut it down for all of our customers. You know, if you're an online marketer and you're cheating the system, it's, you know, they may or may not catch up with you, but they could walk into me someday, and I'm not going to risk your business or mine, you know, by having that in here. That's that's the one thing. But the other side of it, too, is respecting our customers, 
uh, their designs and their integrity. And it's hard for you and I to show off what people are doing because we don't want to let their secrets out of the bag. You know, everybody has uh, you know something that they've created and they're trying to protect it and do well with it. And we respect that. We won't leak that out as, as much as possible. Uh, it's great when you guys can allow us to share it or share bits and pieces because it, you know, it helps us show others that there is success and, uh, and, and, and how successful people are doing it. So that, that's, that's a challenge. I think you might have seen some people have seen. I got permission from Scott to kind of show off what he was doing, and, and I've worked with him now a couple of years. He has great artwork, and uh, he's got a kind of narrow niche. But uh, he succeeds because he does well with his artwork, and he's a good marketer, and then he tries new products, and uh, we were working together. And, uh, you know, we tried those uh, three-by-five banners, and he, he just blew it up in a week. I mean, I think he sold 100, 100 banners in less than a week, and then uh, we started putting out some of this canvas art, and it was, it was funny. He said, you know, I don't know. My guys are kind of old, and they kind of complain about pricing, and, you know, that canvas art's kind of pricey. I said, well, you know, Scott, there's probably some guys that are successful and they'll pay two or three hundred bucks for it. He said, I'm going to try it. And so later on the day, he said, uh, you know, I got a, I, I got my fan page up there and I had some good posts and some uh, good comments back. I got a sales page and he says, you know, we'll see how it goes. Half hour later, he said, I got a sale. And, uh, uh, you know, and I think he sold two the first day or so and I think maybe he's up to four now. And this is just a few days. So uh, it's exciting when we see stuff like that happen. You know, it's awesome. And we're going to get into where you can get some artwork and help with that. And the other thing that Randy's doing for everybody is he put a green screen in his office at, at, at Printex. And once your artwork comes off the presses and gets all put together and all, all, all everything done, he's going to throw it up on this green screen. And then he's going to take a picture and give you a picture so then you can create uh, photos for your website that might look something like this. Right, so now you have some cool artwork for your advertising, for your Facebook ads, and that kind of stuff. And so we're just kind of go the extra mile for you to get in on this craze because, again, the profit margins are awesome, right? Bigger, better, faster. Uh, you know, the video that you're going to watch, um, our, our customer who does this, he said, the "Reason I wanted, I, I went with Randy. He, he's been doing it in China. Now he's switching everything over to Randy. He's like, why? Well, it's bigger, better, faster." Right, and you can talk right to Randy. You can get this stuff done. Plus, he does these green screen stuff for you, so it's better quality, um, all that kind of stuff. So it's fantastic. And you start thinking about this, and you start going, everybody's got a wall. Everybody wants to hang some artwork on their wall. Everyone wants to have something nice on their wall. So I'll talk about a niche that I want to get into. I'm a hang glider pilot, and I have a lot of. I've been hang gliding, you know, forever, and. I want to do hang gliding wall art. No one's doing hang gliding wall art. No one. No one's doing paragliding wall art. You can't get it anywhere. And then I think there's even a, a situation where people could send you a picture, you could mock it up for them, and then create the one-off form as well, right? And maybe charge more for that service. So w this is just a hot thing because now you can spend more money to acquire a customer. And then somebody asked me about um, targeting for this. Well, again, because you have more margins and you can spend more to get a customer you can spend you can just make a broad just a broad target for your niche and one of the things that we're going to do for you and Randy can explain it here in a few minutes is we're going to give everybody on this webinar some designs for 4th of July these designs you're looking at Patriotic is probably at its all-time high for at least half of the country <laughs> right 4th of July is coming up um, I would. I just think we're going to crush it, and then we're going to be coming out with a new theme pack coming up that's going to involve everything from pillowcases to rug throws to to coffee mugs. So now you can build a funnel. Maybe you suck them in with a coffee mug. You upsell them on this and that, and we have full sublimation T-shirts coming. But we want to get you guys going on the canvas art because again, you can spend more money to acquire a customer. You can spend. Uh, you can do a much broader targeting and have some results. And especially with 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 patriotic stuff like this. I mean, I, I I'm going to target offices. I'm going to target. I, we have a San Diego scene that I want to do. I'm going to target San Diego business owners. Um, and it's just endless where you can go. And the other thing you guys can think about is the other nice thing about this is is if you say, "Well, I don't, I need to get some artwork for my niche," Google "artists plus your niche." Google like "artists plus hang gliding." 
hang gliding artists, uh, hang gliding artwork. There are starving artists everywhere. And it's not that big of a deal to go to them and go, hey, look, I'd like to test selling your, your, your work on some canvas art. I'll give you $5 a, a, a thing, or you can negotiate some license fee with them. And it's endless to come up with amazing artwork. You can go buy stuff. You can, there's, there's licensing, there's art licensing sites on the internet where you can just go onto a site and pay a fee, and you can license from thousands and thousands of artists. They're just like, you log in, kind of like a Shutterstock for artists. And you log in, and they have flowers and mountain scenes and, and, and wildlife scenes, and it's just amazing. It's endless where you can get the artwork from, beautiful artwork, and what you can do. And the other thing you got to consider, too, is some of the artwork's trademarked, so you can't steal that, but a lot of it, too, is expired. So you can go and you can get old stuff, and you can do different things. Um, and certain stuff's not trademarked, you know, like you'd like the flag is okay. an example. A, a couple of those things. Uh, backing up a little bit, all those flags that you're showing, that is in the uh, canvas packs that we're giving away, along with everything else you can see on our site, the uh, the different mock-ups, the, the surfing one, the skis, all that stuff. I'm showing them as you're talking. Get you started. Yeah. Uh, also, we were talking about two guys. Anything? You're you're going in and out on me, Randy. I don't know if is, is Randy going out in and out on anybody else. Your audio. Yeah, you're cutting out, Randy. Not sure why. But uh, that everything that. Yeah, no, we're not hearing you, Randy. Shut up and let you talk. <laughs> I, I, I heard that. Uh, uh, I wonder why that is. Um, I hate that when that happens. Anyway, so we're super excited about this niche. I want to build this up to a big, big part of uh, our business, and I want people to start making money. And when you can spend thirty, forty, fifty dollars to acquire a customer, um, it really makes it a lot easier. To get a to get a sale, to get traffic, to get branding for your website, to drop pixels, and the one thing I would suggest you guys consider doing, because I hear people are still doing this and it's working, when you're new and you're trying to get some pixels, you optimize your ads for add to cart, with the idea that if they saw your ad, clicked on your ad, came to your campaign in T-Rex, and then had so much of an interest to click, click add to cart. That's about as close to a buyer as you're going to get. You're going to get more add to carts before you get a buyer, and you want to start optimizing and letting Facebook know, yeah, give me more clicks of people who add to cart. That's going to generate more sales and get those add to cart clicks, you know, optimize for add to cart, and then you can maybe after you've got a couple hundred of those pixels dropped, you can start optimizing for a purchase pixel. But pick your niche, get your artwork, and get going. So here's here's the, here's, here's the, the, the golden goose for you guys. How many people – want to get a free ticket to T-Rex Ecom Live and come see me, Randy, and Bernd Ulm. And Bernd's coming out from New York. I mean, I'm telling you, just, just to come and be in the same room with him and listen to him and talk to him about what he's done with the, the celebrities and the, the branding, $6 billion of deals, it's worth coming just for that. So here's what we want you to do. If you'll take this canvas art, the stuff that we're giving you, and you get a campaign up and go website, and you start some ad campaigns going, that's all you have to do, and we will give you, you, you personal message me personally, Greg, and I will personally give you a link, a backdoor hidden link, for you to register as a guest and come free as our guest, because we're just trying to incentivize you and motivate you, get a campaign up, pick a niche, get some ads running, and let's see if you can make some sales and make some money, and for those guys that are out there crushing, this is going to be easy for you already to do that. So that's an easy way for you to get your free ticket to T-Rex Ecom Live San Diego. <laughs> and, and if you haven't heard of T-Rex Ecom Live San Diego, I guess I'll put that link in here too. All right, well, now let's go to questions. I'm going gonna, I'm gonna to look at the, the notes here and answer questions um, and see what, we, what questions we can answer. Oh, Randy, you got to get the pricing. Uh, is there a link to the pricing or just, a, just the download of the PDF, I mean? Oh, Randy's gone completely. Um, let me pull up the pricing. I have it on my computer. I know that. So let me find it. 
and see here. Cake pricing, pricing, pricing. Randy just sent it to me. I saved it in this folder. I know I did. How did he? It was not. It's not named Canvas Art Pricing. That's the problem. I don't see it. Uh oh, oh, there it is. Canvas Wall Art. Found it. Okay, here. Tell me you guys can see that on your screen. I'll blow it up some. Okay, you can see it. Okay, so there's two different kind of campaigns you can create. You can create a campaign where it's framed, and you can create a campaign where it's just the canvas only. And people have been successful in selling the canvas only, and then sometimes what you could do is you could sell the canvas only, and then on the next page, hey, you sure you don't want that framed? We'd like to go ahead and frame it for you this much. So you could use the T-Rex funnel builder and build a funnel if you wanted to go after that route, or you can just do the, the, uh, you can just do the framed. So the five panel, it costs is $130. That, that's framed and $53 unframed. And then you got the shipping handle on top of that. So I wonder, can I send a file to this? So Carol's asking, does he have pricing for like one panel art? So right now we only have a three panel and a five panel. You have to imagine, matter of fact, I'll show you a couple more pictures. Hold on, let's see. You have to imagine how much work it goes into getting prepared for this. So for instance, here's a screen, here's a photo of all the frames that are being made to do this. So we have to go buy the wood, we have to cut the wood, we have to then nail all the wood together the exact right size and put that all together. Then you have to make sure you get the canvas, you have to get the canvas cut right, then you have to stretch the canvas. So this is a lot of work. This, is, this isn't just easy. So right now, we're just launching with the three panel, which is the same size, the three panel, and then the five panel, which is a stepping stone, where you got, you know, it's a stepping stone, the five, five panel and the three panel. And I don't have a picture handy of the three panel, or I'd show you one. But there actually is one on, uh, yeah, there's one on Planet Me T. Hold on. So let me go back here, Planet Me T. So those are the five panels, and then here's a three panel. Three panels the whole size. So I hope that answers your question, Carol. Okay, so then Adrian's asking, do you have art mock-ups where we could upload an image and automatically splits into five or three pieces for our store purchase? Yeah, it, it's it's kind of like that. That's what that Photoshop training will do for you. Uh, but but like Randy said to you, he, he will he'll mock that up for you. Send him your artwork. He'll mock it up for you, and then with your first order, he'll put it on the green screen and send you some stuff there. <laughs> Mike says, I'm going to do this because I really like Randy and Greg, but I probably can't make the event. That, that boy, Mike, lead the, lead the pack. Let's get some sales going. Uh, Joe's asking what, what was the better better success rate with or without frames and I think that really goes to your market and who you're marketing to uh, I personally would never buy something that wasn't framed I, I'm not gonna go figure out how to frame that stuff um, but I know there's handy people out there that would do it yeah. they, you know for the, are you back I heard one word from you Randy hey maybe you should you should uh, like, sorry Maybe you should cut out and come back in, but don't end the webinar like I did the other day. <laughs> yeah. Because you, yeah, we 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 haven't heard you for a while. Can you hear me better now? Yeah. No. Yeah. Now we're hearing you. Okay. Well, uh, uh, back back to the question on the framed or unframed. I'm not doing anything unframed. Nobody's really sending that in. I mean, I'll, I will do it, but what I'm hearing from most of the guys that are successful. Is it's just really kind of a teaser to get people to look at the price, but anybody that buys the unframed really turns into a, a a lot of customer service. So I don't I don't even offer it on on our our site. So dang it, we heard you. Now we lost you again.
No, we 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 lost Randy again. Not sure what's going on, Randy. That's too bad. Um, and then Mark saying he thought he saw a, a single panel on the bottom. Yeah, this isn't canvas art. This is just this is linked to the, or maybe that is canvas art. I don't know what that is. Or yeah, it is canvas art. My bad. So that wasn't on the pricing, was it? And uh, we don't it's have. Not, but I want to show. Maybe maybe. I can see if I show up if you're muted. Okay, here, let me do that. I'll mute myself. Hold on. All right. Well, the, the, uh, the, the piece there is uh, a personal one panel, and I'm just out on my side. It is something that we can offer and we can all do well. And I think that um, uh, that's where we can all be competitive when we add that personalization, being able to upload a photograph. And so we're kind of uh, testing that out right, right now. We will come up with some pricing, up with some pricing for that. Yeah, you're still breaking up, Randy. We did hear about most of that, though. So if if, if Randy broke up too much, he just basically said we are coming up with a one panel and some personalization. And again, that was what I forgot to say: is we are the only platform out there that can do personalization on Canvas Arts to create. You come up, get creative, create some personalization, create some stuff that can be personalized. For Canvas Art, and you will absolutely crush it, and and no one can compete with you. No one can compete with that. So you you you're gonna demand people that hey, where can they get a, a personalized Canvas Art that's that's beautiful that they want to hang on their wall? So we have to, and we're gonna be working internally on some designs like that, some ideas like that for you as well. So um, very cool stuff. Very cool stuff. Okay, what else do we have for questions? One thing you might show, Greg, is that uh, that one I have of my daughter, where we uploaded a an image, you know, and just do a personal photo. That's something that, of course, can do in T-Rex. Yeah, this one right here. So this is his daughter's wedding, and they just took the wedding picture and put it on there. So it's beautiful. So you could do that with with different things and different photos. And again, I think there's probably a service. You know, when you're selling these things for 200, 250 bucks, whatever that might be, 300 bucks, you could tell people, hey, upload your photo. We'll do the mock-up for you. We'll show what it looks like, and then you order it, and we'll print it for you and ship it to you. That's a whole other service. Customized, customized wall art. You you tell me what you want. So that's a whole other business. So. Dion says, hi, man. Who else is in? Who else is going to do this? Who else is going to, like, create a campaign, get this up and going, he, he, private message Greg, and then say, I'm, I'm meeting you in San Diego. I'm going to hang out with you, you seven-figure earners uh, in San Diego. Carol says she's in. Joe says he's in. Uh, GM's asking, off topic, will we ever do canvas shoes and sneakers? Uh Probably not. Maybe it all depends if we can get them. We can actually do shoes right now. We just can't source the shoes affordably to where we can compete in that market space. So Mark Young says he's in. Cool, everybody. All right. Any other questions? All right. Well, let's call it a day then. It's Friday. Really appreciate you guys taking your Friday afternoon and spend some time with us. I really want to get this going. Um, I want to get some stuff happening. So we really appreciate it. Mark's asking shipping time. Uh, on the video that I sent you that you're going to watch, you're going to see where Jeff said it's it's going out to the customer within two to five days. So it's just it's just like our T-shirts. It's just like our coffee mugs. It's just like our pillows. Randy's turning this stuff around. It comes into him. He's getting it into production. It's coming off the thing, and boom, out it goes um, You know, within two to five days. So you just can't beat that. You just can't beat it. Now Randy does rock, and again I'm going to ask for this again. If anybody can create a video, a video testimony, send it to us in Skype, put it online, put it on Facebook, tag us. We want we want more and more uh, uh, video testimonies for Randy, so we can get keep keep the business flowing for Randy. All right, I don't see any more questions that I didn't answer. So thank you very much again, everybody. Have a fantastic week and have a fantastic Memorial Day. And we'll see you next Tuesday on Ask the Expert. This is Greg and Randy saying have a fantastic day. Talk to you later.